Hello friends, I hope you are looking a best mirrorless camera. So you have clicked this video. In this video we will discuss mirrorless camera which are best sold and achieve top rated reviews from customers. If you want more information and updated pricing on the product, please check the description box in the below. So let's get started with the video. Number 1. Sony 7 III Full Frame Mirrorless Camera. If you're looking for something more affordable, then the Sony Plus or Minus 7 III is a great option. Its continuous shooting speed isn't as fast as that of the Canon EOS R6, and its in-body image stabilization performs noticeably worse, however, it's cheaper, and its autofocus system does an incredible job of tracking moving objects and faces. As far as full-frame cameras go, it's also relatively portable, but it lacks a fully articulated screen, making it more difficult to shoot from unconventional angles. It delivers incredibly high-quality images with outstanding dynamic range and minimal noise at higher ISO levels. Video quality is also impressive, whether shooting in 4K or FHD, and it has superb battery life. That said, its menu system is more convoluted than the Canon. If you want the best mirrorless camera with a full-frame sensor, the Canon is our top pick thanks to its superior image stabilization and faster shooting speed, but the Sony is an excellent alternative for those who aren't willing to spend as much. About this item. Advanced 24.2 MP BSI full-frame image sensor with 1.8x readout speed. 15-stop dynamic range, 14-bit uncompressed RAW, ISO 50 to 204800. Compatible with Sony E-mount lenses can be connected via Bluetooth with smartphones featuring, as of the date of release, Android, Android 5.0 or later, Bluetooth 4.0 or later, iOS, Bluetooth 4.0 or later. Pros. Superb image quality. Great build quality. Number 2. Sony Alpha A6400 Mirrorless Camera. If you want the advantages of an interchangeable lens camera without much bulk, check out the Sony A6400. It doesn't have in-body image stabilization like the Fujifilm X-T4, and its internal video recording capability is more limited, but it's impressively portable for a mirrorless camera, with a compact, lightweight design that still feels comfortable to use. While it lacks eye detection, its autofocus system does a remarkable job of tracking moving faces and objects, ensuring your subject stays in focus. It also delivers impressive overall video quality, especially in low light, and great image quality, resulting in photos that look relatively sharp and noise-free. Unfortunately, its shooting speed is more limited than that of the Fujifilm, and its screen doesn't fully articulate, although it can flip up to face you if needed. Overall, the Fujifilm is the better app-C option thanks to its in-body image stabilization and video features, but if you want something more portable, the Sony is a good option to consider. About this item. Next-gen speed, experience the world's fastest 0. 0 0.02 sec AF with real-time AF and object tracking. Enhanced subject capture, white 425 phase 425 contrast detection points over 84% of the sensor. Fast and accurate, up to 11 FPS continuous shooting at 24. 2 MP RAW with crisp, clear natural colors. Multiple movie functions, make time-lapse movies or slow quick motion videos without post-processing. Pros. Excellent overall autofocus performance. Great photo quality. Sturdy, portable design. Comfortable to use. Number 3. Canon Full Frame Mirrorless Camera. The Canon EOS R is a mirrorless for people who love their DSLRs. It's a hefty beast, with a solid feel that reminds me of what I used to love about film cameras. Even the on-off switch is made of metal. The sensor is typically Canon, which is to say sharp, with good contrast and the characteristic Canon color rendering, it's slightly warmer in tone than some of the others here. The phase detect autofocus is fast and accurate. One thing I really like is when you change lenses, there's a cover that swings out to protect the sensor from dust, the exception is if you have an adapter and you remove the lens, but not the adapter. Every camera in this list would benefit from adopting this feature. The R-mount lens system uses a very wide base diameter, like the Nikon system, and achieves similar results, there are fast R lenses around. The better news for those already invested in Canon glass is that there's a $99 adapter that will let you affix just about any older Canon glass to the R. About this item. 30.3 megapixel full-frame CMOS sensor and digicate image processor. Dual pixel CMOS AF with 5655 manually selectable AF points. 4K 30p with Canon log and 10-bit 422 HDMI output, dust and drip resistant. 
built an EVF with 3.69 million dots, very angle touchscreen LCD and dot matrix LCD panel. Number 4. Panasonic Lumix S5 Full Frame Mirrorless Camera. Panasonic's S5 is a compact full-frame mirrorless with a very sharp 24-megapixel sensor. The S5 mostly holds its own against the rest of these full-frame cameras in still image quality, but what really sets it apart is the extra video features you won't find elsewhere, support for vlog recording, anamorphic 4K support, and uncropped 4K at 30 frames per second top the list. The result is a camera that's perfect for hybrid video and stills shooters. The S5 uses the L-mount lens system, an effort to do for full frame, what Panasonic did for Micro Four Thirds, create a unified lens mount standard. Leica is the driving force behind the L-mount, but Panasonic and Sigma also have plenty of glass in the L-mount. That means there's no shortage of lenses for the S5. The biggest shortcoming is the autofocus. Like the bigger S1, there's no phase detection, and the camera relies on a contrast-based detection system, which is slower and less accurate. If you're comparing it to the GH5 for video, it's nearly identical save the lack of a full-size HDMI port. About this item. A lightweight, powerful hybrid camera for vibrant still photography and cinematic video, realize your creative vision with extraordinary 4K 60p, 10-bit video, FHD 180fps slow motion option as well as 4.3 anamorphic support. Number 5. Canon PowerShot G9X Mark II. This is yet another good option for those who want a compact camera design. The Canon PowerShot G9X Mark II is a perfect beginner camera. Canon built it with this in mind. For one they equipped the camera with a touchscreen interface to make the transition from smartphone to professional camera easy for beginners. It shoots at 20MP which ensures that you'll get high resolution pictures. It doesn't have a 4K video, but 1080p is still good for the asking price. On top of that, you get image stabilization just like Olympus is offering. The battery life on this one isn't great, however. Also, unlike the other cameras on this list, it doesn't have a tilting LCD. Instead, the screen is fixed. If these things outweigh the pros of this camera you might want to look at Sony's offering instead. On the other hand, if you like what this one offers you won't be disappointed once you get it. Features, body type, compact. Max resolution, 5472x3648. Effective pixels, 20 megapixels. Articulated LCD, fixed. Screen size, 33. Format, MPEG4, H264. Storage types, South Dakota SDHC SDXC. USB, USB 2.0, 418 bit sec. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, please like, share and comment on this video. Don't forget to press the notification bell icon to get new update videos. Also check the description box for products link.